Hey lovelies, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be sharing my wash day routine with you all. I will be sharing the products that I use and all that good stuff. So stick around and see. I do want to mention that this is how I wash my hair. I know there are different methods, but this one is easy and perfect for me. So I'm going to first begin by cleansing my scalp with warm water. I like to massage my scalp while cleansing my hair. This stimulates blood circulation and oxygen to the hair follicles, which promotes growth. Every now and again, you will see me squeezing my locks. This helps with releasing any oil or product buildup trapped within my hair. I really don't use too many products in my hair. I like to keep it simple, so I shouldn't have too much buildup, but depending on my month and how much I may have done, like working out, which is rare right now, <laughs> or being in the summer heat, I usually don't skip this part. Also, whenever I am moisturizing my hair or doing a retwist, I like to use rose water, Miel Organics rice water, which smells really good by the way. If you have ever made your own rice water, which is best, it usually has a little funk to it. But with this one, they have really found a way to mask the funk. I also use my own special oil mixture and or Live Natty's growth oil, which I typically put on my scalp and edges. And then I use aloe gel that I make at home to help with holding my retwist. Aloe vera has many benefits for hair. It helps with dry scalp, relieves dandruff, stimulates healthy hair growth, and it's very hydrating and helps seal in moisture. So today I will be using the Apple Cider Vinegar Detoxifying Shampoo by Pure Zero Clean Beauty. I love using this shampoo because it has zero sulfates, parabens, dyes, phosphates, dilates, and gluten. Another reason why I love this shampoo is that it really gets my hair clean and removes any buildup that has accumulated over time. I don't have much buildup like I mentioned before, but I definitely want to make sure that I eliminate the chances of it. So here I am paying close attention to my scalp and making sure that it is nice and clean. Also I want to note that having a clean scalp is very important to your overall hair health, no matter if you are a loose natural or locked. If you are someone who suffers from blocked follicles, severe itching or dandruff, you may need to pay close attention to the cleanliness of your scalp. But I am also not a doctor or your doctor, so consult whomever if you are suffering from any of the above. So I wash my hair when I feel like it needs to be cleansed, but typically I will wash my hair once a month-ish or earlier depending on the state of my hair. Comment down below how often you wash your starter locks. I hear this debate on social media, and honestly, in my opinion, it's your locks, it's your hair, it's your journey. So tailor your wash day or your hair care routine to whatever fits best for your hair and your lifestyle. Remember, this is for you and only you, so what you feel is best for you, and I'm going to put emphasis on you, is what matters the most. Next up, I am using the Trader Joe's Tea Tree Tingle Shampoo. I love the way this makes my scalp feel afterward. It's invigorated with peppermint, tea tree, and eucalyptus botanicals. So if you have ever applied peppermint or any of those essential oils to your scalp, 
you know it will have your scalp feeling cool and tingly and I love it. So I'm definitely gonna say my hair is clean with this lather that I have going on. Keep in mind that some products don't lather as much depending on the ingredients used. And also it could be a sign that your hair is still oily and dirty, but not always. Please share your go-to products and methods in the comments. I definitely want to know and it also gives others an opportunity to learn about other products and methods as well. So in this next clip coming up, we are going to be fast forwarding to me washing my hair out. One thing I want to know is I like to take my time while washing my hair. Essentially, my hair is me, so I am taking my time caring for myself. And it's all a part of self-care, so be gentle with yourself. So we are coming to the end of this video, and I wanted to give you all some affirmations you can use throughout the week. Also, please feel free to share your daily mantras in the comments. We are all on our own journeys, and we can share with each other as a community. I am mindful of my thoughts, and I keep them positive. I am attracting positive results and abundant wins. I deserve a beautiful, joyous life filled with happiness. I am more than what I feel, think, and see. Positive energy nourishes my body and helps me radiate joy to others. Thank you again for stopping by my channel. If you made it to the end of this video, please comment a soap emoji. Also hit the like button if you enjoyed watching. It helps get my videos out there for people to see. And please subscribe if you find my videos helpful and I look forward to seeing you all in the next one. Bye.